We've heard speculation about how budget cuts could impact the military, specifically Shepherd Air Force Base. And this afternoon, 13th District Congressman Mac Thornberry addressed the Shepherd Military Affairs Committee to share his thoughts. Katie Crosby was there and joins us now with more on that. Daryl, it was an hour-long meeting that covered the whole gamut of security concerns, defense strategies, and the federal budget. Congressman Thornberry said Congress has spent more than $2 million in construction projects at Shepard during the past 10 years. He says it will become more difficult to find that kind of funding with a tighter budget. Representative Thornberry said he's worried this administration is putting less of an emphasis on NATO. Shepard's 82nd Training Wing Commander, General Daryl Burke, said he's confident that Shepard will be able to withstand any cuts without hurting the mission. Both pointed to NJEP's importance now more than ever. The war that we just fought in Libya uh, was a great example of partnership from young pilots that trained here years ago that now flew together in, in the NATO environment. And that partnering and that interoperability between those NATO forces is always a, a great thing. What we know is that NATO is the only successful working alliance that really does something. Uh, and it's done something in Africa, it's done something in South Asia. And my point is don't mess up something that works, make it stronger. Of course, when we talk about NJEP, that's the Euro NATO NATO Joint Jet Pilot Training Program at Shepard. Congressman Thornberry and General Burke both emphasized the value of the strong relationship between the base and this community. Thornberry said if funding gets cut for different programs on base, there might be creative ways for base community partnerships to keep certain programs alive. Coming up tonight at 10, we'll also let you hear from a former vice commander at Shepard Air Force Base. He'll share his insight on the role between the military, Congress, and spending. Okay, Katie.